And I believe mine is in the box in the hands of my tour manager. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty simple. Um, but also, then my hometown uh, is having a museum, and they would like to display it there, so I'll probably donate it there next year as well. Um, but I think this is probably the group that, again, understands that most. Um, the colored stone idea is a great idea, but coming to this week, I was just trying to think of what I could do for each of the contestants that you've been seeing this week um, to try to encourage them in some way or something that I could give to them. And um, so I removed 53 of the, of the small stones from the very bottom row of my crown to give to each of them because only one girl is going to win that crown on Saturday. But every single one of those women deserve it. And I cannot imagine what that may feel like when that dream does not come true, but every single one of those women has been serving their country for the past six months, and will go back and continue to do so for the next six months. And they are the ones who are representing this organization across the country. It's not just Miss America, it's not just me, it's not the next woman who will become Miss America who's been doing this job they have. They've been going to the small towns in each of their states that I could never reach, the people that I could never meet, and they have been exemplifying what Miss America is all about. And to the girls that they meet, they are Miss America, even if they're a state title holder. They'll always be Miss America in the hearts of the people from their state. And I want them to just have a piece of that, to understand that they have served a huge role in my year, and so I set each of those jewels in a, in a little necklace so that they'll have a necklace with a stone from Miss America. Um, you can't, and so you won't be able to tell on the crown, it's the very back row, it's very small, so when I'm wearing the crown on the final night, there's not going to be huge holes missing. <laughs> <laughs> but at least I, I just hope that they do understand the role that they play and how huge that is. And that I so appreciate what, you, what each of them are doing. And that I admire each of these women tremendously. Not only because for the next seven years, most of them will still be older than me. But also, I'm thinking about my 10 year anniversary and like I'll barely be older than those contestants. But I do admire and look up to every single one of them. And I want them to understand how important that is.